When seeking treatment, there is really three broad categories of therapies available. There's your small molecule, which is when you can actually draw out the chemical substance, it's chemically synthesized. Those are your pills like aspirin and Advil. There's your biopharma sector, so these are your pharmaceutical giants, and this is where you have a cell that's actually producing a protein, and that protein ends up being injected or infused as the treatment. And then there's this emerging class of therapy called cell therapy. Within cell therapy, there are actually two subsections. There's allogeneic and there's is autologous. So with allogeneic, you're getting the cells from one or many donors, you're manipulating them, and you're creating therapies for many different patients. So it's more of your off-the-shelf cell therapy. For autologous, it's much more specific. So you're actually using the cells from a patient, you're manipulating them, and you're reinfusing them back in that same patient. So it's much more of a personal medicine. Within autologous cell therapy, um, there's many different cells that can be used to be manipulated and brought back into your body for treatment. So today I'm going to focus on the immunotherapy section. And there's actually only one FDA-approved autologous cell therapy in the United States that is based on harnessing the patient's immune system, and that is Dendrion's Provenge. So the dendritic cell is a cell within your immune system that really is kind of the billboard of your immune system. It goes out, it finds a foreign substance in your body, and it presents it to the rest of your immune system to let them know, hey, this is bad, let's go attack it. Now what happens with cancer is that your body doesn't recognize it's foreign. So you don't have these billboards floating around. It's just they kind of go on their way and ignore these cancer cells that are growing in your body. And that's why a common treatment for cancer is chemotherapy, which is you kill all your cells hoping that the cancer cells die off faster than your healthy ones. Cell therapy is very much generating your more natural response of your immune system to kill something foreign in your body. So in cell therapy, and specifically immunocell therapy, when you're using dendritic cells, you would take the dendritic cell out of the body, you would manipulate it using a signal from the tumor or from the cancer, and force the dendritic cell to see that that's foreign. And then you reinfuse them back in the body so that they can go spread the word that this is not good and that this cancer really is foreign and it's able to generate a natural immune response. So it's much more targeted therapy than something like chemotherapy. So it's a really novel concept in this world of medicine and it's a really exciting space to be in.